Dot, Top Tungsten, 180. Or in this channel's case, the tool that we use to decide what football match we go to. So far, we've thrown at the UK, which saw us go to Witness FC. Then we did Europe, which saw us end up in the SIP tier in Norway. And now, finally, we're going global. Where will we end up? The way this works is very, very simple. We throw a dart at a map whilst having our eyes closed. And wherever in the world that dart hits, we will go to the closest football match to it. From Australia to Antarctica and everywhere in between, welcome to our way days. <laughs> Dart at a map, worldwide edition. We're back in Ben's dungeon. We're ready to throw a dart. We've got a map of the world. Whatever it hits in the world, we will go to that game. You've seen the other ones, and this is the culmination of it all. I'm panicking. I'm very scared. Very simple, I have our map. Ben is gonna throw the dart with his eyes closed somewhere at the map, wherever it hits. We're gonna go and watch the team that have a game closest to where it hits on the map. Anywhere in the world. Let's see where in the world we're off to this weekend. Come on. I'm so scared. I'm scared. What if we end up in Somalia? That's not the worst. Not if you're from Somalia watching this, <laughs> I'll just say. Here we go. Turn the camera off. Three, two, one. You've hit somewhere. Oh, that's Ben. We're off to. We're off to. <laughs> we're off to. Well, 4.30. You f***ing dart. One last final throw of a dart. We're going worldwide. Won't see where we're going yet. One final one. Wait. It's been quite interesting watching Ben navigate a big plane. I joke and said, there's an actual Xbox on the weather around. Xbox! Right, so we're in insert country name. I thought we'd come somewhere that would be indistinguishable to prove we're in insert country name. So show the sign. Yes, the <laughs> dart hit North America. You're probably wondering where in North America are we, Ellis? Well, look on the screen. You can see the dart hit Seattle, which means today we're in America. I was watching Seattle Sounders this weekend as spent sport in Kansas City. You might be wondering, Ellis, Surely there was other games. No, this was the only game. We just flown 10 hours for two and a half days. <laughs> but we're doing something slightly different this time, actually. We are actually going to use tomorrow as the day before the game. We're going to go to a baseball game. We're going to immerse ourselves in American experiences today. We're going to do some touristy things. We're going to make an experience. Up. We're going to make, oh, it's a movie. So get a last minute hotel in Seattle. Turned up to, we're staying in a hostel then. Back to the roots. Back, Back to, to where home. we came from. Oh, God. This is where we yeah. die. <laughs> oh, oh, yes! Jog on top. Go on, give us a tour. This is the room. You know what? We're never going to be in the room. It's like, it's, you know when YouTube is going, oh, I'm not staying there. Oh, I'm not doing that. Shut up. We've got a bathroom. No, this isn't the bathroom. Oh. This is oh. <laughs> where I'm sleeping. Right, you know what we should do? Let's go to the club shop for Seattle Sounders so we can get a shirt, and then let's go get some traditional American barbecue food. I'll tell you what, Ben. That's a proper football stadium, isn't it? Proper, proper soccer stadium, yeah. Come on. Let's go get a shirt. Here we go. Seattle. What are we doing, by the way? This dart thing is like crazy, isn't it? We're just in Seattle. A 20 hour round trip for like two and a half days because the dart told us to. Also, me and Ben have realized Seattle are very well known for being the club from the very famous viral fight and win. Fight and win! Video. We are Seattle. Come on, Seattle! Stop that. <laughs> this is what we actually came here for. This very special Seattle Sounders Bruce Lee kit. Oh, well, what else you got? Don't get me wrong. Like I want to look the part for tomorrow, but one hundred and sixty dollars for a shirt. This is one hundred and ten on that and Adidas UK for the authentic. I just I'm not justifying spending that much extra. No chance. Found a clearance section which has the Seattle Sounders Jimi Hendrix kit in, which is like really well loved. It's still one hundred and forty dollars. <laughs> Define clearance to me, America. We've came to a compromise. We've decided we're coming to watch baseball tomorrow anyway, so we may as well just get a baseball thing and then wear that both days. Today, right. our picks was knocked it out of the park. What's up? Was well, it yes or a no? Well, it's down to you, I'd say yes. Allow video recording at the store. 
Oh, okay, yeah, sorry. I didn't got a hoodie. I didn't get anything. We've been asked to leave if we keep recording. I thought because we were getting so... Yeah, oh, because we were too inch. I didn't buy anything because I just... This country is so expensive, you know? Let's go eat expensive food instead. We are about to go and grab food, but I just wanted to say one final huge shout out to Omada for making this season possible. I said at the start of the season, we'd agreed to do 30 trips of Omada, and this is now the 30th video we've done with Omada this season. Thanks to Omada, we've gone to Brazil, Croatia, Italy, Austria, Switzerland, Portugal, Qatar, Germany, Slovakia, Slovenia, San Marino, loads of mental UK experiences, and now finally, America. Yes, a huge thanks to Amada for making this incredible season possible. So many memories have made, so much going on. It's been all possible thanks to them. It's completely free at the top of the description on iOS and Android. You can get involved in my away day squad, or there's squads you can join in with your friends and your family as well, and there's a global squad as well. You can compete for prizes, it's completely free to do. Every prediction you ever make on the app is completely free as well. They've made this season possible for us. Without them, it just wouldn't have happened. The channel would have died. So one final time, can we show some support to Amada at the top of the description? and tap that button there and check them out. Right, let's go get food. Because I'm hungry and I'm about to die. It's like 4 a.m. UK time at this point. Right, I'm not being funny. Americans will be annoyed at us. We're in Cheesecake Factory. We're not in like a traditional. All oh, right, I don't get that annoyed about it. The Brits are here. Um, we'll see you tomorrow for the baseball. Bye. Day two. 6 a.m. in Seattle. We've decided we didn't see the best of Seattle yesterday. Obviously, we were very jet lagged and whatever, very tired. We're going to get there. We're going to go to the Needle Space Tower. I've decided as well, I'm going to try and find an outfit for the baseball and the soccer from a thrift store. And we're going to get some proper barbecue food or something. I don't know. Let's just come on, America. Let's see what you've got to offer. It's a large needle. Do to look up at it? Well, it's 30 quid to go in it, though. Yeah, we're doing it, but can't see me liking it. I just paid for two tickets. He doesn't print it. <laughs> Come on! It's all right, isn't it? It's big. We're 605 feet high, which is roughly the height of Kane's penalty against France. I'll have a look down. I can't do it. I actually can't do it directly down. I hate this. Well, I'm a football fan. I'm not a needle fan. <laughs> Great. <laughs> God. Oh, no. I, actually, I, I, can't. I actually can't do it. Ben. <laughs> This country does good barbecue food. The entire thing is just a wall of gum. I think that we have walls of If I can't find anything Seattle themed, sports themed in here, there's like endless amounts of things in here, I give up. Even if it's a bloody fong at this point, I need something. Go on then, what you found? I know this is going to be a waste of time. Waste of time, yeah. Oh, yes. It's coming up. That did waste our time, yeah. I'll tell you what, I was going to spend $100 on one yesterday, $24.99. Oh my god, we are in America. Like, this is like the first time since being here I've been like, yes. <laughs> Damn, she took that thing off and Let's go ball! I bet over, Mom. <laughs> hello, hello, how are you? Thank you very much. I don't want to do like in-depth analysis here, and this definitely isn't it, but how are these people this good at throwing? I love this club! I love this club! I bleed, Seattle! Please go to the doctors about it. Park. A good Steve R doesn't just annoy one sports fan base, you know. He's well offside! That's what I thought. You can't be doing that in the modern game. Send him off! Send him off now! Come on, ref! You can't do that! <laughs>
nailed down. You haven't got a run all game. We've been here for an hour and a half. Like, I think... <laughs> Hit the ball, come on. This is the moment. Oh. match day we're gonna go get some tickets get a traditional american breakfast remember we're trying to do traditional things and then we're gonna get involved in the supporters march to the stadium which is in like three hours so breakfast is gonna take some time <laughs> okay it said it didn't accept your card i don't know why yeah there we go from verify seattle sounders perfect thank you so perfect. much and try to make have a great day thank you take it sorted let's go get involved in a fan march here we go. I ain't saying it like a week and a half. Let's get a little warmed up here. Getting warmed up. Olé, olé, olé! Olé, olé! Olé, olé! Olé, olé! Tell you what, this is this is good. American, yeah. but what are you expecting for in America? I'll tell you what, I was saying to Ben as well, like, soccer culture is alive here. This, this city, like, there is a lot of people in Sounders shirts walking around, like, it feels here, this feels like a European city going to a football match to me. Yeah, I don't know why Americans, they get a lot of There's a lot of gatekeeping lot from of, European fans. Yeah, they get a lot of stick, don't they, America? So it's growing over here, season after season, it's brilliant. Ben, Hello. the dart has decided our fate, and here we are at Lumen Field, home of Seattle Sounders. Let's have a look down the concourse quickly. You've got hot dogs, you've got sweet stuff, you've got popcorn, m and soda. There's a Starbucks, there's Bud Light, there's more alcohol. There's a wine and beer bar, an in-stadium barbecue. Come on, there's garlic fry, craft beer and wine bar, an Asian food stall, ice cream. I tell you what, it's better than the concourse in England. I, I, know, I know people are like, oh, you have to eat pie. And oh, you have to eat pie and wear a vest of the football, shut up. Let me have a good time and enjoy myself. I'd rather eat things I enjoy. I don't care if you think I'm a beta male. Of course I'm a beta male. Have you seen me? I love this layout. I think that's so unique and cool there. The stadium, I can't, I don't know if it puts into perspective on this video how massive it feels. This is where the ultras are going to be. We're not going to be in there. I don't want to bother anyone, so we're not going to get in there. But yeah, this is unreal. So when we found out we were going to Seattle, I messaged someone who then messaged someone who happens to work at Seattle. And there's potential we might be able to do something cool with the warm-up during the game. We don't know if that's definite or not because, you know, we, we didn't find out we were going to settle that long notice. Yeah, hopefully something cool can happen. Sound is coming out for the warm-up. Um, we'll ignore the fact that Ben just booed them thinking they were the away team. <laughs> You're a baseball fan, if anything. You just love the sport. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
that, like just silence around it was so good. Like, this is good. Everyone in the stadium's doing it as well. So 81 gatekeeper you are, but that genuinely incredible. Match is underway. Um, what are your thoughts on the experience so far? You said earlier, I don't know if done. Honestly, this is the one that's left me. from the breakfast that I can't justify it. Well, we were only meant to see home runs last night. Ah, brilliant. That's really good, that is. Ah, great Real Comedy Channel. Uh, was that actually not very good? I don't know. I just... It's actually 2-0. It's actually 2-0. back from America, looking through the footage. Didn't press record for the pen, they scored the penalty. It's my job. Literally had one job to do. Back to the video. So we've just arrived at the airport, ready to fly back to England. What a weird few days this has been, what a weird series it's been. Seattle was amazing. Weird that a dart led us to three different incredible places that we never would have went to if it wasn't for the dart. Incredible experience with baseball when our massive baseball fans. The stadium was really unique and fun. I think MLS, like I've said in the video, it's not for everyone, but I also think some people judge it before even experience it themselves. It doesn't feel too dissimilar to any European things. If you have enjoyed this and want to see this again, if we hit 10,000 likes on this for some reason, we'll do this again somewhere else. But if not, then it's been a fun little trilogy Thank you for watching. Just this season in general as well, in 2023 especially. But I've been Ellis and I'll see you very soon for more football shirt content and more away days. So I'm very, very tired. Ciao, ciao. Bye.